I think we had, um, Venus and Light Lime up for comms last I looked. But where is it? Yeah. It's on Trap. It's on Trav White's okay. channel. And, uh... Yep. Thank you, Trav and Shadow, for this. Thank you, ZSR, for restreaming. Yep, GG's, guys. Thanks for the great rest. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to, I'm going to pop it out and everything like that. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's look good. How, how do people who uh, read your chat in light mode see your attack 9 emote? I have no solutions. <laughs> Stop messing with me here. Hide members. My screen. My screen, man. I'm going to go get myself a drink, refresh, I'll be back. Yo.
Hey, Light, are you seeing, like, what's your aspect ratio on this stream viewer? Oh, is there a stream viewer I should be looking at? Uh, yeah, in, well, not, I mean, in the channel that we're in, he's streaming it to Discord. Oh. I didn't even see that. Yeah. What I had done is just pulled their streams up, but yeah, let me check. Oh, yeah, I know. I'm about ready to do that if I can't figure this out. But it's all like, um... This music. Uh, one second. Yeah. Is that better? Oh, you're fine, you're fine. Okay, yeah, That's... that is better. There it is. There you go. All right. With that, I'll hand it off to y'all. All right. <laughs> yeah, let me close out of there. That was really quick. Um, this one's going to be pretty hot. This is only round two, you know. So, yeah. Yeah, it is. Uh, I'm I'm looking for a real good... I'm going to learn something, I hope. Right. I watched, helps. I watched all those videos you sent me. Oh, you watched all of them. <laughs> Yeah, oh yeah, that watched the whole playlist. I'm like, you know what? I got to do that for Gauntlet. I got to make a playlist. Yeah. Yeah, I think those were all relatively okay. like newer strats too. But um, these people right here, they do all the strats. They do all of what I showed you and more. That's what makes this race so good. Yeah. They both have the same magic yeah. container cave, so they're going to have similar patterns going to the double bubble. Might even see the same double bu bubble ha pattern together. Back to back, same frame. Yeah. No, I, I want to see. Yeah, I want to see like a very similar looking uh, pair of runs here. We at can least really at the start. see like, yeah, to see some really, really tight. Uh, like, oh, you can compare them directly. Yeah, I do know they great. they use like relatively different strats in certain areas. But to be honest, I haven't seen React play live in like th this whole year. I'm not sure if he's like mm -hmm. maintained what dude does or he's doing his own thing. But he's also like a pioneer of like a lot of different little strats. So you never know. Oh, yeah. I'm yeah, sure React's avid really, ride or uh... die fans would know them. <laughs> don't know if React has a reset stick. I think he used to have a camera that showed his like whole backside <laughs> as he was playing. We need that back. Uh, other people who have had cameras that were like behind them, I think um, at one point maybe Error did. Oh, uh, I don't know. The Countess. Yeah, I mean that was very short lived for if it was if I'm remembering correctly. It would have been, yeah. Two bags, two bags. Um, one thing that Error did, you know, maybe like 2013, 2014, because he would say it, he or he would let us know in the chat. I know these like, patterns. He can't read chat, but because his back was to his yeah, computer. Yeah, exactly. Right. Which I thought was I, I've recognized these patterns in a run the other day, and I knew exactly where to go. That, oh, really? that I would get the back spawn here. Yeah, that's so funny. Oh, but they set up differently for it. I just set it up like, dude. All right. Oh, but they had different spawns right there. React also walked into the heart, and dude jumped into it. Both consistent. We're if going you for a kill here. You know what you're doing. Okay, that one goes into him. That, those left spawn. It's Link. Oh, React had the way oh, faster. God, I spawn. like React spawn better. Yeah. It was faster and easier, and the back spawn. Oh, nice. Look at the tiny differences. Some of us aren't even doing these manipulations at all. <laughs> we have a race. You said it too early. <laughs> Trail says it after, like, I don't know, Death Mountain. 
Oh. Uh, I think, like, as soon as you start the race, there's a race. But maybe I'm not understanding. <laughs> no, I think you might be onto something. <laughs> The other name oh, look at that. <laughs> what I miss? Oh, we have a oh, bomb. Where, where did React take react the bomb? Spots. Where did uh, React take the damage? Um, I think bots dove on him on the way into the room. Ah, oh, that's brutal. You really no, gotta slow down. Uh, that's so annoying. No, it's the Stalfos. Okay, it was the Stalfos. He... Gotcha. Yeah. But on his way out of the that room, the bots kind of both jumped down, but he was able to clear them with a jump. Right. Hug the Stalfos. So I was playing this game the other day, because okay. I was making a video for Half- or I was going to say for Half-Life, for Highlander, and uh, I skipped all the Stalfos. It was great. No Stalfos damage, no violence against them, and no violence against me. I suggest doing it. Wow. Nice. <laughs> yeah. That attack three? Yeah. It's two on one at the boss. Mm -hmm. Pretty fun. You get attack two on the the second to last orange IK. Wow. What kind of time do you get out of P1 with that? Um, the best way to measure the time usually is like right when you start placing the gem, and you can get it like a 639. That's with double bubble, obviously. And the best P1 time I've gotten is like a 648, which was insanely perfect. I haven't had like an insanely perfect uh, P1 enemy skip yet. So the enemy or the uh, the encounters that React had is still giving him a good lead. I wish I could see a We're split. See I should have kept this dude up. catch up a little. Ugh. Yeah, have a little bit of trouble with uh, sync though. Yeah, that looked cool. Dude did coming up the steps here. Yeah, that was that's a fun strat. You just look for like two bricks away from the wall and you just jump and throw a beam and it always hits that top one. Cool. I still haven't mastered this chewy fight. Yeah, beast. yeah, there's a few different ways to kill it, huh? All of them look pretty cool. Except for the all crouch step one, I guess. <laughs> oh. Nice bots. Always jumping. Yeah. Always be jumping, ABJ. ABJ. A little different from ABCs. Oh, React messed up his. Uh... Whoop. He got it, he got it, he got React. it. React! <laughs> oh, see, dude didn't take the notes. Dude. He didn't miss the first hit. Oh. Yep. Five, six. Whoa. Right through the skelly. Oh, Weird. React trying to get real fancy on that, maybe? Yeah, like, Link, maybe he had that no, thing where Link's momentum, like, carries him really fast forward out of a jump, you know? That can throw you right through the skelly. Oh, I love that. Yeah, it's it's good in some cases. Oh my god, dude. I just think I'm it's super neat. Oh, dude. Yeah, you don't like to see that. You either want both attack three or no. Nerd. Unfair. Unfair game. Oh well. Yeah. Race over, everybody can go home. We'll keep commentating, though. Yeah. I'm okay with that. Down to watch <laughs> some Zelda 2. <laughs> Morning, everybody, by the way. 
Oh, React did the thing that I love. Nobody does it. Uh, he stopped his t stop tile, like below P1. Is one tile, uh, mm -hmm. like above the cave exit entrance thing, so that if you get a back spawn, you just hold left and you don't waste any steps. There's no reason to go down the extra step. Because if you need to go up and dodge, like you can still just dodge up and over, even if you don't get the, the back spawn. Right. But if you get the back spawn, yeah. you save a step. Same thing coming out of uh, Trivia okay. Cave, you can do that, but it's a little scarier. We no longer have a race. <laughs> yeah, by so some people's definition, the race is not occurring now. Sometimes it doesn't even start when they both start. I guess dude just needs 200 bags and he's fine. Dude's really good at like chain double hits and stuff, you know, from playing any percent or whatever. If you just get 200 you know, bags, I... then it doesn't really matter. Gonna, he's gonna put extra hits in. He's got to. I mean, he, he has to make up uh, a thousand experience. Yep. As well. But you know, a lot of things are gonna happen in this race, and they're not all gonna favor React. So, uh, I learned how to drive a tractor on Thursday. What the heck? It's an automatic. Yeah. Oh. Man. <laughs> you need a license for and that? Or? How that relates to Zelda 2. No. Is uh that that tractor handles great like Zelda 2. Oh. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> Quick on its feet can reverse momentum with a BA, you know. Yeah, it's got a quick turning radius. Yeah. It can haul a haul a load of stuff behind it. <laughs> Probably has a better turning radius than a Supra Mark III. Those things turn like a boat. Is that... Is, wait, does... Okay, so does turning like a boat... Is that is that a good thing or a bad thing? I've heard this, but I actually don't know. No, that's a bad thing. Okay, they turn like a boat. <laughs> that's a bad thing. Gotcha. <laughs> A tester of one when I was a kid. Did you with say my a dad. Supra Mark III? Supra? Toyota Supra? Celica Supra? Not an actual Celica Yeah, Supra, yeah. But... Which one is that? Is that the. That's the six inline? Is, the six is that like one of the boxier? Yeah, yeah. It's the one with the hideaway headlights. Came out in the late oh, no. 80s. Whoa, we're in Baggy's Forest. Yeah, yeah. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, he went a tile early. Sucks. So give, I missed give it. it away was the it, advantage. That was like an input error. It must have been. It wasn't like forced. It was an unforced yeah. error. Gotcha. There, it's wide open lane. Enos, you know, so are you listening to the? Uh... All right. So the race is already ended twice. Are you listening to uh, Trav's stream? Like the uh, the Discord stream? Yeah. I don't know if it's causing it, but uh, I think you're hearing me like a few seconds late. Just FYI. Since we're in town. I'm hit, you think I'm hearing you late? Yeah. I, I, I can just kind of tell. Um, late said. <laughs> okay. We can do a test if you say, I hear you right now. Now. Yeah, that was like three seconds. Could be vice versa. I could be hearing you late. I don't know. I'm not listening to anything. No, um, my internet's really bad. Uh, yeah, that could be a thing. That could be it. 
It's all good. I was um, just curious. I'm also was... I'm like stuttering a lot watching this. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's probably just like internet stuff. Don't worry about it. All good, all good. Yeah. I was so... just trying to diagnose it, actually. Yeah. So dude got a huge lead coming in here. This is the kind of lead that really makes up all the combat time that he'll have with attack three in Death Mountain alone. Plus a little more. So that's pretty pretty nice for his attack three state. Like if Riak gets the hammer first, he played insane and dude made some mistakes for sure. Yeah, I just didn't want to cut Yunus off, you know? That's all. I think it's okay. Oh, the bat. The last bat. The last enemy. Have... Has dude gotten to his first big drop yet? Probably no. Should be coming um, no, up. No, because he did the all the kills, so yeah, it's after this red Dyra room. Or it's after the room after that even. Yeah, um, why why was oh React just did the first one, right. Okay, the orange dyra is the first one. Yep, yep, yep. If you do it, yep. Okay. Enemy twelve. Basically. Technically thirteen, but you know, yeah. no one wants to kill the blue gorilla. Which, going back to my attack 3 forced P1 strat, it actually, you leave there with a 3 count, so it puts your your 6 kill on that blue, the second blue Gorilla in Death Mountain. Pretty awkward. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, it well, is nice. Is it awkward because it's difficult to pick up the bag? Yeah, with the bat there, you know. You gotta have some kind of way to deal yeah, with the bat. Yeah, okay. Yeah, dude's not getting too much XP. Um, can he have attack four in the last room? Seven. Yeah, yeah, he can. Earlier, I did a no reset run where I, you know, I don't know my experience all that well the route. Uh, but I was three one two coming out of P one, and uh, and I ended up at Helmet Head three experience short, and I left behind like you know hundred hundreds of experience basically. Oh no, that sucks. Yeah, did you get like a couple bags and thought you were good? <laughs> Is that what you're saying? Uh, yeah, I did. I had a lot of bags, and I just didn't... I, I mean, I just don't know my... I really don't know XP routing. I don't know what I should have at any point in time to, to know, like, oh, I can stop this or do this. Right. Yeah, I was yeah, watching that. You were, saying, you were saying, is this a louder's worth of XP? It's a loud, yeah. I mean, I didn't... I, like, jumped over all the, the crap on the bridge... You know, the Death Mountain backdoor bridge. I, I skipped all that on the first part, and, you know, it's all kinds of stuff. Yeah, where'd all that... That's a dude, lo like, getting the level up. Yeah, uh, they, extra uh, dude, got the, dude got the hammer a little bit later than React. But to be fair, like, getting all red jars and not getting the early attack fours out of your hands... I say reacts. early, it's like already at early. 1600 experience. Yeah. Yeah, he has potential for. Oh, wait, he can't get a bag in the heart cave. So I was going to say potential for attack 5 before P2, but he doesn't have a drop coming up. Would that get the Chewies down in two hits? Um, yep, it would. It might actually mess the strat up. 
it would be so fast. I never thought about that. I don't know if I've had attack <laughs> 5 into P2 for a long time. It, sh it shouldn't mess it up. You'd still, you'd still get pushed back on that one hit, and then the next two hits you're usually helicoptering over anyway and not getting pushed back, so... No, you're right. Yeah, as soon as I was questioning it, I re realized that the down stabs, like you'll still get those same point. Yeah. Oh, a little ho L hot strat by React there gets to skip the encounter directly off of the uh, road uh, with the graveyard. Yeah, that's a good one. I was that's, thinking a little bit about that. That's a good one to pick up. The only way it doesn't really work uh, is if you take bops in the bridge before it and get random walk. So if you know you're going to get random walk, then you shouldn't do it. Yeah, that's that's what I was thinking about. Is uh, is am I like used to getting random walk? Because I don't do that. I mean, I just I just hoof it straight to that little chunk of desert between the road and the graveyard, and usually get by probably by virtue of random walk. Exactly. A lot of times, the fact that you're just in the overworld so long, you, you get, like, random walk. Especially since you're not exiting that bridge at, like, a perfect frame, you know? It's one of those ones where, like, they kind of track you, but then don't, or something. I mean, whenever you get the boulder dash on the that perfect tile, it's like, they're always random walking around you. So annoying. But directly out of that yeah. bridge, usually it's enough that you're just dodging that one. If you If you do the bridge correctly. Or, you know, if the bubbles allow you. Okay, one upset at the Video same time. Dude, pretty good. Right. Dude went out right! <laughs> is, this a, is this a random walk strat? Wait, they had like the same style of pattern right at the bat. It's kind of funny. Alright, well, it, it works. Both, both confirmed it's work. Back spawn. Nice. We have to hope for a little bit of good RNG on dudes end until they get their same attack levels and everything. And then we're like, alright, even. Keep it even. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna read some of chat. I haven't been keeping up with chat. Yeah. Sonic strat was high when El Hot and I messed with it. We made a backup too. You waste like two steps. I wonder where those steps are. Oh, like on the graveyard road, you think, or something? So that you don't get. You skip the timer one or something? I don't know. Yeah, I'm not really sure. Yeah, it's like you can know the rules of this game, I'm but you really gotta. See if it works. Really gotta figure it out. I hope Rep wins this race too. I'm not really sure if we're even in a race still. Someone said it might be over. Well, it's a best of three all in one <laughs> race, so. Is this race two? Uh, I guess it's like one and one currently. Yeah. Uh, no, because the the race ended when uh, when React got attacked for and dude didn't. Then the next race ended when dude got to Life Town, like when React walked into the Bagu Woods. Oh, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Th we're on race three already. But we're just gonna pick up where the previous ones left off. Yeah, it was a long one. What the heck? How this. Yeah. <laughs> Before the grass spawn on the road. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Bounce with react with the. Uh, is there some neutral jumping there that helps get that Garia closer? Oh yeah, so that you can downstab it. Um, yeah. You. I think you I've skip been... the first Mew. I let off the, the D-pad yeah. for that one. You let off the D-pad when you downstab the louder, and then, yeah, you you let off the down... Yeah. You basically let off every jump you make, yeah, I think. But you don't kill okay. the first Mew, that's that's key. Look at this. Okay, dude's in good position. React, also good. They should both make it to the road. Yep, nice. all right. 
Swamp Dude, Walk Part no. 2. Back oh my spawn. God. Perfect. No, nice. they came back. Road spawn. React wins this race. On to <laughs> okay, race best four. Of five. <laughs> best of five. About to be a first to five real quick. <laughs> Dude got unlucky. The encounters were going completely away from him <laughs> and this came back. Yeah. I don't get it because... Um, I guess... The difference is that, like, dudes random walk, they didn't fuck off far enough? Are we on the wrong channel for that? Is this speed gaming? This is just some speed gaming stuff. Okay, this is- You got- right. you got clipped, it's all good. <laughs> <laughs> um... So- It is- it is after hours right now. <laughs> if, uh, so if- if dudes didn't get far enough away, then they will- track back in when random walk ends but if reacts got far far away they're not ever going to track back in yeah unless like he walks back type. into their range right the yeah. little grid thing oh that was a beautiful four bounce from react <laughs> i never thought about that so there's a there's a grid that if they go off it they actually just stay away yeah, you remember, do you remember the little image that shows, like, which yeah. way the... Yeah, that thing. So, you remember there's a diamond where they, like, the diamond and where they track into Link, but outside the diamond, they random walk. Oh, but the random walk can come towards you, right? Right, it can, it can okay. go any direction. So, if it comes back into you and then, like, global random walk is over, then, yeah, they'll track. I see. So what you're saying is like the ones on dude's screen came back into the grid and then hooked onto him, like aggroed onto yep. him, basically. Gotcha. Yep. That's cool. I didn't. I didn't remember that. It's such so an interesting cool. game, isn't it? Like, yeah. The mechanics of this game are they're just so much better than most games of its time. They're just a little. They're more thoughtful. Yeah. I mean, all the th way through the NES. Yeah. This is a pretty early on NES game too, which is kind of funny. It really is. But I mean, it's like, honestly, it's kind of a pinnacle point. Like, they did some things better, but as far as design-wise, and it really yeah, did some it, things as, as well as any game ever did. It's interesting because like a lot of NES games, when it gets break, broken down for speedrunners, uh, it's like, oh, this doesn't make sense, but we understand how it works. It's like, well, this that biz makes sense. All the encounters, the way they work, makes sense. It's kind of cool. Even if, like, as a casual player, you might, you might be like, that makes no sense. Like, <laughs> they went all the way over there, and then they tracked me down. But yeah, it's like systems in play. Yeah, there's complicated <laughs> stuff at hand. Cool. Oh my god, the four? No! Oh, he oh got the God. head in, though. Yeah, yeah. Broke it with his head. What a move. <laughs> wow. Yeah, you gotta That's, do that for three yeah. or four. Good reaction. That's unlucky, but very good. Dude showing that you have to kill all those, and at attack four, you can kill that red IK with a rising crouch stab. Just go for it. You just gotta... You just gotta go for it. It usually works. Like, the red IK usually oh, yeah. is not aggroed. Doesn't even need the bag. Tabby also got to, got to skip that bag in his race. Yeah, uh, yeah reacts like way ahead on XP. Already 122 XP ahead. Yeah, dude's a little could behind. Take, could take magic too. That's true. Yeah, yeah I think he really saves hurt. it for the refill in P3, but I would take it here too and just hope for a lucky red jar. Just to get the little time save. Oh, he's gonna have to kill like all the blue Salfos. Yeah. Dude, this despawn today. Yeah. It shouldn't despawn. No, it does. Oh, it I did. don't know why. For the love of God. It's so weird. If you don't if you kill the first red blue skelly or the second, if you just like kill one, leave one alive, it usually spawns a he third does. one. I don't know why that just doesn't spawn. He's he doesn't need it though. He's fine. He actually has enough. Yeah, because he needs 1950, uh, so he needs 400 more. Three 350 more. Yeah, he 
Yeah, he has to get the the crumble breach bag, I think. But yeah, he's good. Other than that, yeah, he's fine. I would have been fine in that run earlier if I hadn't taken magic too. I just didn't think I was gonna. I was plenty of XP I left behind there. Nice chewy skip right underneath. Yeah, super lot of space too. Like it was not even close to hitting him. Man, what are we playing? Hundred percent NMG. What's going on? Need all this XP? <laughs> Oh, there you go. At least he gets the attack. Five. Yeah. All right. And now what we want to watch for like uh, pausing strats on oh, the yeah, pedestal so, to set up random walks. So yeah, if React did his fight correctly, he's gonna know how long to pause here. Wow. That was he a big also, one. He's also gonna hesitate to let the XP tick up. Nope, he's not doing that anymore. Never mind. Forget me. Okay, so the random walk setup, but you saw it track back in because it didn't get out of range. Yeah. It, it was random walking inside the diamond, effectively. Let's see, dude's walk. Oh, okay, just cold so right. his random walk. Oh, yeah, I if he, he would have helped, right? have gone up. Oh, he would have been. He might have been okay. It would have put him farther away in the diamond, for sure. Yeah, exactly. Because it was going, the the left one was not oh. like, tracking right immediately. <laughs> oh, nice! Out of the diamond! Okay, well, React had a good walk, but dude got pretty lucky. Did React also just have one? Yeah, he had to. Uh, React... Just yeah, the they, one? They both would have had to have the one for him to be... React ran into there. one on the road. As the dudes drops, the whole run will be bags now. Yeah, <laughs> it'd be okay in P P three. Could, could use one there. Oh, do you like the uh, the pause and visual for the uh, the Shield Town exit? Um, no, honestly, <laughs> it's kind of it's it's kind of without uh. I don't know, I'm, maybe I'm not looking in the right place, but like, you, it's pretty tough to look at the the road and grass tiles and, and see that differentiation. I probably should be looking I'll at the mountain. You. But I got by anyway. I got by anyway. I see, I, got, I see. I got lucky. You, you use the swamp to line it up. You can actually line it up with the last use tile the of the swamp. swamp. Yeah. It's pretty far away though, visually. Like, It might be. I'll show you this image I sent along with when I was doing that PB review for the person I made those for. And I think it'll just mm -hmm. click immediately. Yeah. Oh, uh, so you can do that same thing that you were asking about earlier on this blue green in here, but React had his really... F See how dude just got that? Same, same mm -hmm. difference. Yeah. Same jumps. Easy walk. It's actually this the same room. Awesome. Oh yeah, it is. Effectively, the, the, the <laughs> yeah. The reason why the enemies aren't despawned is because they've gone into P two, right? Yep, that's right. And and Shield Town now. Oh, the town. They've, yeah, yeah. They've changed banks. Is it? Yeah. If they change banks, jumping over. Yeah. So in Rando, it can actually yep. screw you over. You might kill the enemies and then go into another one and be like, "Oh, this is a different cave." Got to be mindful. Or the same cave, rather. Yeah. Oh, King's Tomb as well. Yeah, King's Tomb is also in a town bank. So right. that also resets it. Um, I don't know if you noticed, Yunus, they're walking from the cave to the palace. Uh, what about that? Uh, they just pretty much go straight for it. They don't really stop yeah. anywhere specific. You just hesitate a little bit before the first encounter occurs, and you just go for it. If it if the encounter happens in the top of the rocks on that island, 
you can just go and if it occurs a little bit later when you're above the rocks and it's on the same horizontal line as you you just dip up into that little little area of desert right above you know you got like two little slots going north and south you yeah. just go up in there and go around them I don't okay. think it's exactly free but uh it's it's it works like the the thought process and, and that's the... yeah. yeah and that that's also assuming you get a no stop blue gorilla room right i think that's what kind of helps you figure out if it's going to work or not yeah yeah i haven't been playing and that's relatively newer so i haven't been able to like mess around with it I did it once on the fly in my Hundo NMG run, and it worked, and I was like, alright, cool. Good strat. Funny to watch people use the uh, the fairy on the item strap at Fairy any early. <laughs> Reacted yeah. that one. We're gonna see a jar oh, see here. That? And oh. stab! Oh, it didn't work. Yeah, you can have any kind of setup, right? It's always gonna fail at some point. They are frame perfect. Although the Aaron jar one is like a massive group of frames, apparently. Is the Aaron jar being the one in P6? Yeah. The, yeah. the screen wrap jar. More, more, uh, it'd be pretty hard to mess that up though, right? Because you hold right, you jump, you're holding up. Um, yeah, I guess your jump timing is the only variable. You could still jump, uh, too late, yeah. I guess. You could jump late, I, but I wonder what part of your hitbox collides. Is it the, the right side of the weapon's hitbox or the top side? Hmm. Oh, that's a good question. I feel like it's the right side when I do it. I get pretty high. Could be wrong. Yeah, I, I think if it's the right side, then it's even harder to to mess it up. Gotcha. I think it's easier to mess up if it's the top side because then, it, yeah, the jump timing is going to matter more. Over the first blocks. All right, we got a pretty hey, tight hey, race, hey. so <laughs> <laughs> we get high. Still you in game this. four. Bowling. Save corner. Oh, that's a good enough. Yeah, good Safe fight. dismount corner fighting. Faster fight on dude's end. Faster hits and faster dismount. Pretty good. Man, these two are just so solid. <laughs> just neck and neck the whole race. Yeah. Sub 35 30. Like a couple of giraffes. Yeah. Uh, lower end 35s are great P3 times in races. Oh, a nice double pause. Why are the colors different? Uh, they have different palettes. Like, I believe React is using like a standard NES. And Dude is on an RGB mod one that has a selector. I could be wrong. Someone correct me if React does have an RGB modded NES. But I always thought he had just like a... Standard one. See that. Honestly, the capture doesn't look composite for React. Yeah, it's so hard to tell on Twitch, right? Stupid bitrate. It, it well, it's hard to tell, yeah, with this this bitrate. But React looks pretty clean no squiggles on the lines between the life and the magic yeah and yeah dudes dudes palettes are really custom and, and really garish got a very distinct palo nobody else seems to have quite that much distinction between all the different reds available in the palette yeah very sharp too like the uh, picture if you look at his setup I think is in his description mm -hmm. on his main channel. He uses like this gaming uh, enhancer thing in the middle of his setup. Just enhances. I don't know how. It's for like Xboxes and PS4s and stuff. 
Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. I have to go look at that to get the exact details, but I know there's some kind of like HD gaming thing in the setup. Dudes had more different uh, like pieces of equipment that he runs his whole feed through than anyone I've ever heard of. Yeah. Sometimes multiple. You never know if one's going to break and you just need it right away. Yeah, when I was trying to figure out RGB myself, uh, he lent me a, like a bunch of random stuff just to see if it was my CRT that was messed up or etc. He has a lot of stuff to play around with. Yeah, dude helped me out too. Helped me out a lot with my RGB setup as well. Yeah, yeah, he's your guy. If you need help with RGB, if he's willing to help, uh, you will learn everything. Well, you'll learn what works and what doesn't. React just dodged well, uh, a couple of fairies, apparently. To get over here. <laughs> That's saying something. Fairies in the Dazzle are rough. Super Jumper? Yeah. Oh. Oh, oh and he did the fairy low. It's all good. Good effort. I appreciate it. All good, all good. My eyes! That's I'm That's a pretty tough series of inputs. <laughs> yeah, I like to do the jump, get the max height so it doesn't feel like I'm wasting the jump spell, you know? Gotta clog yeah. up that one. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, back in the day, people used to have to always super jump, and I bet more than half of the people doing it switched to claw for it. The only time a lot of these people have used claw. Unless you're playing like a contra. Yeah, just even pressing select when you come in. Yeah. Is it common for people to uh, play Cla Clock or Contra or maybe Mega Man? I'd say less Mega Man, but more Contra and like uh, Cobra Triangle and stuff. Because I do. Ooh, Cobra Triangle. I, I don't know. Yeah. I'm not familiar enough with that how that game plays to know how Claw benefits it. Cobra Triangle, you have to That's hold the A button for your accelerator. Ah, oh, it's awful sounding. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I've only ran Mega Man X and use a claw grip for that too, but since it's on the SNES, you do like the sideways claw. Because you can do two inputs with your index finger and then just use your thumb for the shooting. But the NES controller's not yeah. set up well that for that. Oh, nice. That's I like love if the you thing. watch like uh, Super Metroid. Yeah. All right. I don't. I just don't get the advantage of this setup. Which one? Reacts? Yeah. So, I can explain that. Uh, it makes the first encounter set de despawn before the second one happens. So, you can't get put into a, a quad surrounded situation. Okay. Because you're, you're so far away when the first one occurs. Same with the one that you, I don't yeah. know if you noticed, okay. Chroma like, was, <clears throat> was bottom left in his. It has the same effect. Mm -hmm. But with, with Chroma's, he's yeah. even further away. So you don't have to hesitate later on on the third and fourth encounter. They occur at the same time, so you can dodge them more easily. Yeah, I definitely noticed that part of it too. Okay. Yeah. No. Oh. Yeah, both are great. <laughs> the one that React does in the top left, you have to do a manual delay. Um, I, I think that's what you said React did. That's what I do at least, top left. Yeah, it avoids slinks. The only thing you might have React. to slink is the second one. Yeah, React setup, he's, he did actually almost get completely surrounded because his didn't despawn before the second. Interesting. Uh, I think that was some pretty bad luck overall. I'll have to check that. Yeah, because it is random walking, right? It might have just been like the worst of the luck. Yeah, I, yes. I think it does. Yeah, I think it was some random walking there. Yeah, because we don't stab out of that last encounter. Which, yeah, I... Yeah. I do... I switched to Claw for the ocean tile, yeah. 
there, there are definitely some things in this game that I was switching to claw for besides just super jump. Um, I can't remember what they are right now. Yeah. I used to too, but I've I've since only done it for super jump. I can't remember what I used to do it for. I think the starting T-Bird hits, maybe? Not anymore, though. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because we used to do a thing where we stood more right, and you would cast Thunder while, like, being in the air, pretty much. But it's obviously just way easier just to, like, cast it while you're running and then jump and hit him. <laughs> it's really easy. Yeah. Much easier. Yeah, Chosen's a double right, thumber. You see that? Death. Like BT. I do double thumb on the overworld. Yeah, I, I used to try that to get some thumb relief. It's just not enough. It's not enough. <laughs> yeah. You gotta do bunny it's hops. Not... I was gotta... just. I. It. I gotta say, like, I know it's shocking to say, but I actually can play, I'm able to play all keys less than I want to because of my thumbs. Yeah. <laughs> Can you believe that? Can you believe somebody wanting to play all keys more than their body would let them? It makes sense with, like, when you've ran this game, it, it makes sense, but yeah. Back in the day, Dazzle called that Iron Thumb. You have to get the Iron Thumb before you can do long hours. You have to just, like, constantly work through the mm. pain and it goes away. But it depends on the pain, right? That's not literally every scenario. No, it's... No, I mean, that was long enough ago that I don't know how old Dazzle was, but he's not 41. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> or a doctor. He wasn't 41 when he said it, probably. And yeah, or a doctor. Like, just damage your thumb until you can't feel it anymore. That didn't work for me. Uh, it went the other <laughs> way. I, I just kept playing and it kept getting worse, and I had to quit the last All Keys tournament that I was in. <laughs> Yeah. It was so bad. That's rough. That does suck. It sucks. That's okay. It'd be different if it was a job it, versus a hobby. It's like, you're telling me I can do my job, but I can't do my hobby? That sucks. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Double-fisted grip. <laughs> Trails uses the double-fisted grip. You know, we all got our grips. Some people are okay with just the one hand. I don't even want to imagine that. Sometimes you can only use one hand. Not enough space. close jumps. Justin told me it was like a pixel you can look at to do those blue skelly jumps. I was like, why did I... I use visual cues for everything. I never thought to do it for the blue skellies. I just like jump close, like based on feeling. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't think about it either. Yeah. Huh. I use like visuals for almost everything. Maybe more than normal. And I never thought about that one. Especially... React break in that one block at the bottom twice now? Yeah, that's kind of cool. It's a cool habit. It's kind of cool, but scary, because if he, if he breaks the other block, then you're going to have a really bad time. But it happens on the way... I guess you could jump. As you get the key... Yeah, I don't know if he has enough time to grab the key, stab two blocks in one strike. That'd be kind of crazy. There's always it's a way it's on the way up, up, right? Yeah. What's sure. it? What? Whose law is that? Is that like Murphy's law? I don't remember. Anything that can go wrong will. Yeah, I don't know. I know Moore's it's law not, doesn't apply to this. It's not though. Cunningham's law. Yeah. <laughs> Cunningham's is the best. <laughs> The, the best way to get the correct answer on the internet is to give the wrong answer. <laughs> True. I do get corrected a lot in Twitch chat. 
You ever just start typing? You're like, I know the answer to this, and then you type it and you finish it, and you're like, wait, I'm stupid. Can I resend that message I just chat chatted? <laughs> <laughs> Type a message, you're like, no, if I help these people, then I'm gonna be <laughs> buried. I'm gonna get buried and answering more questions. Just kidding. Oh, true. <laughs> Delete. Do I really want to get involved with, in helping this problem? Because this isn't really... <laughs> Alright. Wellington. This could be the end of game four here. Ooh, we got one miss. Two, three. Oh, oh look at this beginning for a dude. I had this the other night, too. Oh, man. Ria had like eight, seven or eight misses. Oh, dude's having that's... a terrible go. Oh, yeah, we're at already this. at like seven or eight. Oh, my God. Yeah. It's like double. Two quick ones. He, he did everything he could. That's true. Well, he didn't walk out there and just take it into his own hands, you know? Definitely his fault. No, he didn't do that. <laughs> yeah, let's go out and read the RNG. Just know all 256 patterns. True, yeah. I mean, come on, man. Are you dedicated or not? So, do you think it in a century from now, in speedrunning, speedrunning will exist in a century, People still be running games like this. Do you think that's a strat? Like memorizing those kind of patterns? Maybe like a handful at least. Um Honestly. No. <laughs> People will still be smart I... and know how to wisely spend their time by then. <laughs> yes. That's that is my assessment. Um if it were us, if like our lives get extended and we're actually still able to play two eco keys, by the way, that's Double good. banana. Still in game four. Um, then yeah, we might be doing it, but I don't think the people who are living then will be doing that. Yeah, you're right. That's a good way to look at it. Like the people who have already started to spend time on it. How much time do you... Because if someone's learning this game now, in one year, they can get close to world record. They can get like a 74 in one year because of all the resources. Um, I guess our strategies aren't very well documented yet. But if you were to ask the right people, you could get them all pretty fast. But like... Yeah, we've been playing for so long and it took us so long oh, just shit. to get to 74 that... Now we know everything, we just need to learn more. New stuff. That was a good one. Dude was... Yeah, dude had a much better block room than React. Yeah. Yeah, our augments, for sure. Yeah, I just... Oh, yeah. I just think about the difference between life now and, like... 1922. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And know that change is happening happening more rapidly than it was then. Between, you know, then and now, it'll be happening more rapidly from now to the next hundred years. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. there'll be some sort of more... I, I don't know what that's going to look like. Um. <laughs> Which one's Moore's Law? Uh, every 18 months, technology doubles. Something okay. Like that. It's an exponential kind of. Yeah, it was used like during. I don't remember which era that started. Computer era, though. Transistors on a silicon die doubles. Okay. Not necessarily technology doubling. That sounds like it's over. Yeah, I think so. So, let's see. What do you think about uh, item death abusing in P5? If you're on a PB run, you know, you're these two people. 
and you got that one last life to use. Do you do it? No. Do you really think you can sell it in a race or a you... PB run? No, I was saying in a PB run. Yeah. Mm. So that, what would that? That would just be at the recorder, huh? Yep. Right on the blue IK. Um, doesn't sound worth it. How would it be worth it? Well, if you die elsewhere, is your run good? Is it still good? If you take the death of Beast and GP and lose 8 seconds, for however long, like is that yeah, still... Yeah, those are 8, 9, 10 seconds. Is that still a worthy PB for, you know, React who's sub-1430 or dude who's 73? That's what I was most curious about. Hmm. Might get a I mean, second PB. I guess so. I get, I, if that's where you're you're heading, yeah, I guess then you take what I mean you route the best death abuse as possible. So yeah. if that's the death best view, death abuse possible, you do it. Yeah, you're not gonna you're not gonna be having accidental deaths and I mean GP's not that hard. No, it's more like VOD might happen, right? You might take a hit in VOD, you cast life, you might take a second hit, what do you do? Maybe you cast life again. And then you have no magic. That's the only situation I could think of. Yeah. But like you're saying, like, I mean, even if you take Magic 8 before GP, these guys can go through with only casting Jump and then get to T-Bird. So, yeah. I was just curious. I, I started doing that Death of Beast like a few years ago. But I was, obviously I'm not even close to world record, so I thought it... I didn't know if it was, uh seen as like a idiot move or overconfidence no uh, no I, I i mean we've we've been over this whatever you can make the run as hard as you want yeah that is the beauty of speed and... running <laughs> i mean i can't make a fellow any harder but that's not a serious speed run yeah, there's there's the outliers for sure. <laughs> I just like to mention the Othello speedrun because it's such meme trash. Is that like a board game? Literally the worst. Yeah, the the Othello the board game, the NES speedrun, where you just win one game and you just need the RNG the computer's RNG to do the dumbest moves it can do and to just happen to get it to compute it the correct speed. Yeah. Okay, still nice. Still <laughs> nice. That makes sense. That, those kind of games fun. where you just manipulate it. Makes sense. Yeah. Oh, they both did the same thing, I mean, but I don't no, the Guma it. That outright. Yeah, you're not. Right, right, right. I know what you mean, though. Yeah. I'm just, I'm gonna call it out one more time. It, you can, I got the world record in Othello in like... 15 minutes of playing from <laughs> never having played it. You can do it too. Just play Othello. Just... <laughs> just just pile on the, the world records. To make a YouTube video from yeah, start think... to finish 15 minutes of teaching how to yep. get the record. <laughs> just a copy of the, the raw video. Yeah. <laughs> of me doing it. Just That's live commentary it. over it. <laughs> These two have been on the same distance between each other, like the whole the whole race. That's kind of incredible, no? Yeah, we're still in game four. Yeah. I think the biggest distance between them has been like 15 seconds. Life four, yeah, dudes. Dude has only taken life four. Are these gonna try to cut like you know that six seconds or four seconds oh, or whatever did... it is to? He did the thing. Remember when dude used to do life four and gotta PBS make games? up these. He's crazy. 
I don't remember four. I remember five. Yeah, he used to just do life four as well. I'm sure he's done some kind of amalgamation of all these different life levels, but yeah, there was React a little gets while the door pixel. before seventy three that he was doing life four. Yeah, dude. So, dude did the thing where you wait to the right and then hold up and left. Does that work? Yeah. If you, as long as you don't hit full acceleration before you enter yeah. the room. Yeah. So he hit it full acceleration. Get the, you should get the pixel. Oh, nice. Double nice, maybe. Oh, that's a good pause. Nice, double nice. Good. I saw that. I saw, I recognized the pause. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you can recognize it. You can do it. At least I can recognize when I'm about to fail. <laughs> That's the most important part to learn something. Or knowing how to fix your problems, at least. Yeah. All right. We got this. Oh, the back spawn. Nice. Everyone's getting back and spawns the next today. next spawn Aww. now. Wait. Random walk. Yeah, that looked weird. <clears throat> He had just a tiny bit of random walk. Literally one, like, one square's worth of random walk before they he, started to track again. Yeah, dude shouldn't have gotten that encounter, though. So, Chroma's saying he hesitated. You should still be able to get a little bit of distance before you get that, I think. I've messed with that for a few years. Nice. Easy kills. Bag. Well, React solidifying a bit of distance now. Kind of scary. For the dude. Yeah, that... That might have been... Dude getting that bag there and those encounters might be the end of game four. Yeah, we can call that one. Okay. Alright, on to game five. Game five. <laughs> <laughs> Really hoping it's not a best of seven. It's got too many to keep track of. <laughs> I think Reacts are already up three to one. Yeah. Any fairy out of the houses? You got to do that in a race, right? I, I keep doing it because I keep messing up my menus and I just. I hit the menu and I re queue fairy and I'm like, well, now that I've done that, <laughs> well, I gotta do it. Now you're saving time. Now you're mitigating time loss, yeah. I'm, I'm cutting losses. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Every, I must have wasted 30 seconds worth of mismenuing in that runner earlier today. Real, oh, dude. The, is this gonna be the two frame saving entry? Yes. So why does that save frames? I don't know. Oh. It, if you are basically in the doorway and you can hold up as the animation ends, you get you save two frames, and I don't really know why. Hmm, okay. You Was just this get like a faster. thing that got posted? Or the animation stops faster? It's, it's been known for a while, yeah. It's been like years old. Two, three, four. Yeah, I missed that one. Oh, for Highlander would know, I think. We'll have to wait a couple weeks to get that information from him. Yeah. Rip Highlander. Yeah, he's probably at work. He's going to be at work indefinitely just constructing... Uh, what are they making? Transformers. Additional pylons? They are constructing oh, additional said... pylons. <laughs> in, some kind of, in some kind of fashion. 1,200 in a week or something. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> My life so. for higher. <laughs> okay, triple stab. The third one you can do a low stab. Don't to do the third big stab. Oh, a little late. Ooh, late. Okay, both are doing the full stabs. One, two. Oh, and he does the crouch. That also works. As long as you, you know. Yeah, there's evidence it worked, but they moved away. 
Yeah, that third stab, it doesn't need to be, you can do a crash yeah, stab and then jump out of it. That entry. This thing dude's doing where he comes from above. Yep. You know, that's it's a pretty easy thing to do. You just wait for them to move and then you like go left and down, but like, I don't know, I still don't do it just because of the, consist the consistency of the bottom spawn. But then with the bottom spawn, you still like randomly take the encounter, like trying to get into the palace itself, like after the whistle blow. Might be just worth yeah. doing the, the upper route, no matter what. That's another situation with a, a random walk that ends and then they can track on you. Yeah. And so the extra steps of the bottom route gives you more margin for error. Or more, more margin for the aggression of the counters, I guess. Yeah. I mean, the the upper walk, the encounter doesn't even spawn until after you've blown the flute and mm -hmm. you've taken a step. Yeah, exactly. Any quantum? Which I really don't understand. Aren't we going two steps up or down? Uh, uh, no. The upper route is less steps. Is it? Is yeah. is the heart above the the whistle point? Okay. You know, if it's less steps, it's by like one. I'm not really sure. I can't think of the map off the top of my head. I yeah, never, I, mean, I don't the, do the upper route, so the heart's definitely not. Yeah. The heart's not two steps above the palace, though, I know. Yeah. I mean, that, there's no way. Ooh, okay. I thought React wasn't making that jump. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, picked it? Yeah, but the, the first, like, the initial jump, it looked pretty far away. Just the right perfect pixel. That's a pretty wag, uh... Set up for uh, a little bit of a 50-50, a and then a little bounce around, a little breakout <laughs> yeah. for the bubble. Yeah, and he's really up in the to game those. there. There, people are really starting to like increase that. I remember watching just like you know make it do the the grind, the rail grind, and and then yeah, just the reacts like, oh, I'm not gonna have him do that. Like, before too long, man, we're gonna have, like, a ten-part trick. Oh, dude got the ceiling walk, oh, nice. didn't he? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, React's crazy for that. He barely hit these enemies with the flames before going over the lava pit to fight him again. Yeah, dude's safe for that, because it's just one to kill, but... That was cr a crazy fire room for React. That was pretty sick. Whew. See, I like having my red jar drop on that red IK. I don't like getting in on the Tektites. I think it's less time save. And you know, since Aaron Jar's around, it doesn't really matter. The, the always jar. Aaron Jar's pretty solid. Yeah, you don't really need that red jar anymore. In, on the six count. Alright. I also like to count my small enemies in here and get the blue jar if it's on that Mew. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, that's basically just free 16 frames. Yeah. Yeah, if you know it's a drop, then it's pretty good. React doing the Who's over Who's going to jump right? into the left side of the gap and stab off the wall? I know. Yeah. No, they both do it, but dude, at, oh, at least dude made, made the jump. Made it, yeah. The React is definitely downstabbing this. You can tell when they're like halfway off the platform, you know? And then dude is doing mm -hmm. a, no, a jackhammer going no jump. You can always tell. Body language, it's like watching people drive on the road. You yeah. know what they're about to do. Like I, I see you don't have a turn signal on, but I see you. You're gonna, you're gonna change lanes without a turn signal. You see their head flicking around in like. there.
Yeah, I am a fan of no jump in this room ever. It's a good, easy jump out. You know? Yeah. So as far as like actually purple, these these Moas are the only fl uh, purple enemies, right? <clears throat> like a true, mm. like deep into the purple yeah. phase. Yeah, right? Some are like blue yep, to purple, so. like the Doom Knockers. Yeah, and the blue Stalfos. Yeah, they're. <clears throat> but yeah, no, they're the only purple enemy, I think. Yeah, petition for more purple enemies. That palette, I like that color purple. It's really good. Oh, the purple so bot. So dude's about 70 seconds behind right now. That's but not much. We're about to come into the VOD. I just want to get that. No, it's not much in, in the VOD. Obviously, it's gonna. We're gonna see a big. Probably see a big change here. I took the stupid hit. I'm so dumb. There's too many projectiles. React is doing a little delay so that this encounter kind of, as you eloquently put earlier, I'm not going to say it, they move away from you. But uh, he didn't get the slam. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and dude doing the same thing and he gets fairies. That's so stupid. This game sucks. Only two stabs? Is he crazy? <laughs> okay, we're good, we're good. These stabs can and cannot work, I'm pretty sure. Like, it's... I don't know. The frequency... It's right on the edge. Yeah. Oh, look at this. React's having a... Oh, oh, no. That did not turn out well. Got too many yeah. back spawns. I guess, man... I don't think he would have made it if he got forwards, but... Yeah. This'll do it. This bot will do this to anybody in a race. Doesn't matter how good you are. You'll get back spawns and you're not really prepared for them. I was thinking about it, like, after the first uh, lava encounter skip, could you do some rep stabs to set up a random walk for the next, for the first spawn, for a better chance of getting around it? Yeah. Yeah, we've talked about this I don't know. Uh, recently, yeah. actually. Because I was telling someone they were confused of why they were getting random walk outside of these encounters when they were doing beam strats. But they were crouch stabbing the first eye, and I was like, "Yeah, if you if you lose any time in the screen, you you can get random walk." And it's okay in certain areas, and then mm. obviously bad right before a skip. So like after the first lava skip, that's right. one of those places where it doesn't matter if you you waste some time. Yeah, it was Trav. <laughs> that's funny. Yeah, that's one of the ones that's okay to do it on. I, uh, I think that's viable. Experience. Only a couple stats. Yeah, coming return. in with a weird number. 59 How did he get to. How did he get an odd number? Oh, he probably. Oh, because of Bago oh. Bagos. Oh, okay. Bago Bago. They can. What do they give? Three or five? I hope it's three. But that, would have I don't know what's three. going on. It was the bot. Even still, it was the bot. It was 2xp. Oh, he spelled Max. Okay, I didn't catch that part. That makes much more sense than him killing nine enemies for three XP. <laughs> yeah. You were doing some crazy math. Like, this is possible. No, I mean, to get to a seven off of threes, yeah, yeah you, you have to kill nine enemies. <laughs> <laughs> math, dude. I love math. Come on. Hmm. I like doing math in this game too, even the while room playing, that, the... but... Kinda hard. I'll... I like it better when I'm not playing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. The room the dude's in now is the first one that makes me nervous in any percent runs. Like, oh yeah, crap, if... I could screw this up. This will all be yeah. on me too. Yeah, if you look at his pattern he had, oh my god. That's the messed up pattern. That's the one where you're putting a stab into one of those heads. <laughs> Knives.
<laughs> Dink. They, these people keep juking me. I think they're going for the jar because they pause up there instead of, like, downstabbing onto the elevator, like... Hmm, right. React just do the despawn? Oh, I guess he did. Wow. Nice. Why, why yeah, are React, we on speed gaming? React is, uh, he was working on, like, a newer one. You know, same concept, but just, like, a setup or something. So I guess he's using a, his own setup. I think he was pretty confident that it worked because he, he just started digging down. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, React has been working on it behind the scenes. I know this was discussed already. Like, will people do this? Will people not? Uh, I don't. I don't really care. But I think it's cool to, to see. But for me, yeah, I don't care. I'm not gonna do it. Not really. I mean, to know no how to do it is just one thing. Yeah. Man, life forward. He had a cash shield there for sure. React needed a little bit of XP to get that refill. Yeah, it's potentially slower, and it's another point that we bring up a lot recently is how hard do you want to make the game? And removing things that you find fun or, like, difficult kind of sucks sometimes. You know, like, any percent went down that route for a little bit. Now it's not. Now it's gone up the route. But yeah, if it's also potentially slower, there's that point, too. Yeah, taking the grind out, you mean? Yeah, for any percent, taking out the grind, skipping enemies in the first area. But now they've added, like, you know, frame-perfect tricks back. Mm -hmm. More of those, so... There's a different type of difficulty. Nice fight. The grind. Yeah, the, the old 17 No! Rank. React trying to give away game 5 by missing the key pickup. Oh, basically same time kills. Oh, they missed the key Keyboard together. Platform. They both missed! What a couple of bros or something. <laughs> so they are bros. It's like, if peeing your pants is cool, then consider me Miles Davis. <laughs> These are great races. Is despawning Pikula a major glitch? Yeah, this is fantastic. That is a low 75. Boom, react. Wow. Man, can you believe that? Dude got a low 75, and React's just like, yeah, I got a pr <laughs> like pretty much also low 75 to beat this guy. <laughs> like, holy sh... That's awesome. Difference of 14, 15 seconds. Yeah, that that's like 14 seconds. Wow. Oh, incredible. Not only that, but they're both just sick race times. Yeah. Oh, yeah. GG's. Yeah, huge. Huge GG's. They pretty much had the same distance between each other the whole race. I don't know if Dude... Dude had a lead for, like, somewhere in the early part. In the early, the first half, I think. I can't remember where. Um, he, the, the part that he had the lead was in entering Lifetown. Yeah, that, that was it. Because of React's problems at Bad Goose Woods. And then React that was took it. the lead at Hammer. And that was yep. it. Yep. That was it. React had the lead for the rest of the game. Yep. Made the same amount of either mistakes or RNG issues all the way through. They were less than a second apart after P3, Leipid says. Yeah, they... Morning. Yo. GG. Uh, thank you. That Yo, was sick race time. Wow. <laughs> Can you imagine all of those bags it's... early on? Yeah, and... Um, dude was getting red jarred like crazy through the early parts. Like, you had attack 5 in the Chewy room, right? It was in Medicine. Medicine, right, right, right. Yeah. Oh, wow. 
Yeah, that React took all the ba took all dudes' bags. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you were watching at all, like keeping track of like the where you both were. I wasn't this time. I had the stream up uh, kind of behind me, and I was tempted a couple of times, and I thought, no, I'm having a good run. This is this is just I'm having fun with this. Uh, yeah. I didn't check until I think Firetown, and I saw we were like basically in the in the house at the same time almost. And I thought, oh wow, nice job, dude! Like this is closer. This is pretty close. And then yeah. I just thought, okay, I didn't look again after that. I just uh, kept going and did my thing. I think that's smart. If there's no reason for you to change, like, because you might want to like get a race and be like, oh, do I need to save a life here? Blah blah blah. And if you're just having a good run, yeah, there's no reason. You're just uh, going to do your best run, and you win if you win. Because yeah, that's there's... crazy, right? Dude put up a great time, and you you just put up just a way lower 75. Like, this race time for dude wins 95% of races. Yeah, with attack 3, too. That's amazing. Yeah. Um, yeah, and we were just talking about this, but you took the lead at Hammer and pretty much held the same lead at P3. It sounded like you both matched up pretty well, but then after that, you were both within 15 seconds of each other throughout the rest of the run. Wow, nice. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, other than the the crazy drop look, the only time that it that I didn't get the drop that I wanted, I think, was before New Casuto. I got a bag instead of a jar. I think everything else was exactly what I needed. All bags early. Had a jar in P5. So I could ferry after the block room. Like Pretty much everything else was great. Had a jar go in P6 on the way to the cross. Um, Really good VOD. Uh, actually, damageless GP, I think. Oh, wow. I oh, wait, no, no, no. No, no, I didn't. Never mind. I did cast life once. I I remember I had beams for the, but I did I, I did cast life. But uh, Beakily despawn. How about that? Yeah. <laughs> Been practicing that. So did that you down. um? Did you you dug down that waffle? So did you think you hit it or knew you hit it? Like what was? No. Uh. So I've been. It was well. I I sort of developed that as the strat where I it, it's kind of hard to get through there without dropping down by the bot. So mm -hmm. I just jump down there and save myself the XP, make sure I have an extra ten and and account for it that way. And um, it's just like a one frame tap is all it is. You got I think you got one or two pixels to do it on, and. Uh, yeah, I can't believe I got it in a run. This is the first time I've gotten it in a run. I've done it in practice a bunch of times, but never more than maybe 40%, you know, ish, which is not bad, but um yeah. Yeah. Nailed it. You know, this is one of those uh, those runs that gets uploaded to YouTube. <laughs> like you sick race times, you got like the first ever, you know, despawn in all keys with with a setup. Right. That this is a great this was a great one. Is this your fastest race time ever? Uh no. Um I've had a couple actually faster if um the finals last year in the tournament was a little mm -hmm. faster. And then I think I had okay. one other seventy four mm -hmm. earlier last year's race, but uh, I haven't oh. I haven't done this well uh in a while, so really happy with this time. Yeah. Well, you should be. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when React got the, uh, one of the 74s last year, it was the fastest race time ever. It was like world record race time. In fact, that but, was a PB at the time. I PB during the race. Yeah, it was the PB oh. one. That was also the fastest race time ever. Like, we checked SRL just to double check and everything. Uh, I think Lordo now has a slightly faster 74. Yeah, later in the tournament, Lordo had like a 75 or 74, 30 something or it might yeah. have even been a high 20. I can't remember, but that was that was nuts. Yeah, that's the new record for race time. <laughs> yeah. By a lot. But yeah, not a lot to say about this run. Everything went really well. I, I don't really have any... I, I, I guess, okay, I should say there was one thing that I did, which was the Bagu uh, mess up. I just completely... <laughs> I had some like D-pad miss... And it was my fault. You know, I just... 
press down early and <laughs> I did it and yeah. I thought, oh, great. You know, there goes the race. <laughs> but uh, uh, yeah, that did give dude the his one period time period of having a lead is entering Lifetown. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, well, yeah, that was that was a great race. Thanks. Yeah, thanks, yeah. man. Thanks for the commentary and Trav for the last minute restream. Appreciate it very much. Yeah, I'm glad this one got covered. Like seriously. Alrighty, with that, I guess we'll sign off here. Uh, thank you so much, you know, Slight, Reacting Dude. Thank you all of chat. Uh, we'll see y'all at the next one, and I will upload this to YouTube. So, <laughs> it'll be there. Nice. Alright, good night. Thanks. Have a good night. Y'all have a good one.